at the beginning of October 2022, YouTube came up with the idea of charging people to watch videos in 4K. Now, I produce videos. Some of them are in 4K and some of you may be watching some of my videos in 4K. It's not always in 4K, sometimes it's it's less. But anyway, occasionally I do it. However, if this idea had actually gone ahead, you'd have had to pay for the privilege. You'd pay for the privilege via YouTube Premium. Now, I get a lot of people saying to me that they don't like adverts. Well, it is actually the adverts which pay for things. I can't go to a filling station and get a tank full of diesel on likes, but I can do with the cash that comes from YouTube advertising. But if you don't like the advertisements, then you can buy premium and that would take you uh, out of the advertising uh, system. YouTube premium, it gives you a lot, not just um, watching without adverts, but there's all sorts of other stuff, music and uh, lots of other things as well. But it costs various amounts depending on your country. Now, for example, if you live in Denmark, you pay the most uh, for YouTube Premium. Um, if you live in the United States, I think it's $12. In the UK, I think it's £15 or thereabouts. If you're here in Poland, it's 24 zwote, which is just over $5. But if you're in India, it's about $1.75. And if you're in Argentina, it's, I believe, $1.50. 45 or thereabouts. Argentina, as far as I am aware, has the cheapest YouTube premium. So uh, if you're not in Argentina, of course, you can't be tenure in Argentina. You do this by getting a VPN. Unfortunately, you have to pay for the VPN, but maybe the, the difference in price uh, is still worth it. You then set up a, a Google account. You must set up a new Google account and uh, pretending you're in Argentina, you'll need an address, but just look up uh, any business in Buenos Aires and you'll have the postcode and the address and then you can just pretend that's where you are. So that's how you uh, avoid uh, paying so much for YouTube premium services. But to come back to the 4K situation, what's happened with that one? Well, it seems that YouTube has given up on it. There were so many people who complained about it, they've decided not to do it at all. So therefore, as from now, you can continue watching in 4K with advertisements completely free of charge. So if you found that interesting, you can join me because I also did find it interesting. But this is not usually the sort of thing I talk about in my videos because normally I talk about motorhomes and camper vans. Thanks for listening.